Hello, all right, all right, all right. Welcome to another one about my stumps, World of Tanks, Xbox 360 replays. And today we are on mines, and we're in the Sherman Jumbo. Uh, gonna end up with a, a fairly decent game. Uh, we push the center here pretty hard. Um, and then decide to move out and uh, pick off some more reds as we go. We have a couple people come up and help, and uh, it works out pretty well for the most part. I'm going to get up here into position and uh, see some uh, reds over there, but they're not my concern at the moment. My concern is getting up on that hill before a bunch of tanks block it off. So we get a couple up there already. The SU-85 there. Try to take a shot at him while moving, and it didn't happen. But so we got to plan is to go over here a little bit and shoot from up top. But then I realized that uh, there's only one person holding the hill. He's half dead. Oh, there's another one pulled up now. So there's two there. But I figure, well, I'm gonna go help him. Good place for this tank, Sherman Jumbo, to be sitting right here. Can bounce quite a few shots, just like he just bounced. <laughs> but we take a little bit out of it in that time. And uh, I'm gonna pop one into that Crusader. And then here comes that uh, Sherman thinking that he's King Tut. And we track him. So we hold him right there, and I back up out of position a little bit. So he can't hit my bottom plate. His buddy comes up to help him, which kudos to him. It moved me out of the way, so my next shot bounced, which really sucked. But you know, that one right there didn't bounce. We finished him off. And uh, here comes a uh, AT2. I don't know what he's doing. I have no idea, but I switched to premium because uh, I want to just kill him quick. I don't want any bounces. So we ammo rack him on that shot and finish him off. Uh, right here, as usual, I have a tendency to forget to switch back <laughs> from premium. But uh, I remember here in a second. I think right here, I yeah, I clicked back to regular ammo right there and finished him off. I really didn't need much. I mean, I didn't need premium for that 82 either from that angle. But with uh, the way World of Tanks RNG just randomly, oh no, you bounced. I didn't want to take any chances, I just wanted to get rid of him. Because more than off, more often than not, there's a tank sitting there that you should pen easily and it bounces for some reason, you know. The miracle plate of steel that they welded in that one spot or something, I don't know. Uh, Churchill takes a shot at me. I tried to take a shot, but it was just horrible. That was, that was a dull moment. I'm waiting to get a solution on him, but I keep on thinking, well, he's going to move up, he's going to move up, but he never moves up, so I said, well, it's time to see what else I can find, and uh, he kills my teammate there, so I said, okay, now it's time to, it's time to take him out, oh, but wait a minute, there goes that Sherman, the easy eight trying to go across the field there. I like that one right there. Takes him down and leaves him with like what two health, 26 health, just pathetic. And there again, kill him, and down to 14 health. Seriously, so that's why I use premium on that AT2 because it's very common that this happens. Whenever you have a tank low one, oh, there's a nice low roll right there, of course. And you'll see the next roll on him once again, a low roll and leaves him like five health. If I got a decent roll that time, this next shot would have taken him out. But no, 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 not with RNG. Not with this game. We gotta hit him right here and leave five health in him. Yeah. That's just random. It's just a random number generator. Just random. Completely random. <laughs> so we see the M41 and let's see the random generator work again. Aim for his center plate and hits him in the friggin' track and takes his track out. Of course. So yeah, we're doing good with that RNG. Can you imagine the game I'd have 
if I didn't have all these random, you know, it's, I seem to have games like that constantly, where if just that one extra shot, I would have had eight kills this game, easily, because I just like this guy right here too, I come up on him, I miss that shot, my next shot right here, should have killed him, but no, it leaves four health, of course, that happened like five times this game, it's just pathetic. It makes you not even want to play the game sometimes, you know. It just gets you so frustrated that how many times during that game did I leave a tank with 5 health, 7 health, 12 health, 24 health. Whereas if I just got one more decent, one decent roll in there. But anyways, I digress. We get the top gun out of it. We With our multiplier for the day, two times, and for the being the top of the top of our team, we get 7400 XP. 18,000 silver because I used premium. And we took 307 out of the heavy T1, 113 out of the Churchill, 375 out of the EZ8, 410 out of the Crusader, 280 out of the e AT, 514 out of the Jumbo. We end up in first place, 2100 damage, 6 kills. So, uh, yeah, that's not a bad game. I shouldn't complain too much, I guess. But just, it just makes me think of what kind of game I would have had if I hadn't had low rolls on that last shot over and over again. It just frustrates you. But, anyways, 29 hits on 34 shots, 26 penetrations, and uh, we took 136 damage and doled out 2100 damage. That's pretty good. And if you get that ratio, that's a pretty good game, so I shouldn't complain, I guess. But I still would like to have seen that. That could have been 2,600 damage. But anyways, as usual, please thumbs up, thumbs down if you like. Rate, subscribe, tell me what I did right, tell me what I did wrong. And remember, when them RNG ticks you off and, and you're just frustrated and frustrated, just keep firing that gun and shoot the red ones.